Just a few months ago, Barack Obama fought for the presidency at the Belmont Town Hall presidential debate. Now he's taken the oath of office, with Belmont students and faculty here to witness the historic event. A huge crowd filled the Beeman Student Life Center Tuesday morning. Nearly every seat was taken, and some people even took to the walls, the floor, and the other levels of the Beeman to watch the first African-American president take the oath of office. Belmont students expressed their excitement at the historic event. It represents a lot of dreams fulfilled and prayers answered and just to see people rally around a political figure for whom normally we have so much skepticism and disbelief. It's very hard. I just really wanted to see kind of like what it's all about and um, I think it may be the first inauguration that I've seen on television where it's in college. I've never really experienced it with just this amount of friends before so it's going to be really cool. And for some students, 2008 was the first year they could vote in a presidential election, making this inauguration especially meaningful. We're just becoming adults, so it kind of celebrates our rights to, like, you know, actually vote now and just make a change in the nation. Belmont faculty also turned out for the event to show their support for the new president and to share the moment with their students. I'm thrilled to watch Obama's inauguration anyway, but I thought it would be a lot more fun to be here with a crowd, and especially with a crowd of young people who were a big part of how he got elected. Members of the Nashville community were also at the student-sponsored event to witness history being made. I'm excited because this is a great event in my life, and I'm just happy that I will be able to be a part of, of a great contribution to our United States. And some felt that Belmont was an especially fitting place to watch the inauguration. I couldn't make it to Washington, so I'm making it over here. Since he came in through to do the debate, so it's fitting to end it this way. The crowd erupted in applause as Barack Obama was sworn in as the 44th President of the United States. And while the crowd at Belmont was smaller than the crowd in Washington, the emotion and enthusiasm were no less evident. From Belmont, I'm Abby Selden, Vision News.